Hello, good evening, Katia. Hola, buenas noches, teacher. ¿Qué tal, Katia? ¿Cómo está el día de hoy? Bien, bien, teacher. Me tocó ah, inscribir okay. la pelea de la U. Ah, ok. ¿Cómo le fue? Esa es una buena pelea a todos los ciclos. Sí, prácticamente es una carrera ahí por un cupo. Así es. ¿Do you study at the University of El Salvador? Sí. What are you studying? Relaciones internacionales. Okay, international relationship. That is a nice major, right? Es una carrera muy bonita. Sí. Hello, Roberto. Hello, Milagro. Hello, Catherine Giselle. Good evening. How are you today? How are you today? Hello, teacher. ¿Cómo están el día de hoy? Are you? Very good. Very good. Okay. Excellent. Catherine Giselle, how are you today? I'm fine, and you? I'm okay. Thank you for asking me. And Roberto, how are you, Roberto? Hi, thank you, teacher. Okay, it is nice to see to listen that you are nice, right? It is nice to listen that. Yes, va? teacher. Excelente. Yes. Okay, perfect. Me alegro que esté muy bien, ¿verdad? Ya casi es viernes, ¿verdad? Ya, ya, ya casi viene el fin de semana. Van a descansar un poco o trabajan los fines de semana. Do you work on weekends? Do you work on weekends? ¿Quién trabaja los fines de semana? Nobody. Me. Ah, okay. I'm sorry, <laughs> Maurice. I'm so sorry. Hi, how are you, teacher? I'm fine, thank you. How are you? I'm fine too and happy too because my cell phone now is good. Ah, okay, excellent. That is a good yeah. news, right? This is yeah. a good news. Hello, Luis. Good evening. How Hi, are you today? good evening. How are you today? Uh, today is was um, interesting because uh, today in, in the mo at morning, I, I have a big job. Ah, okay. Congratulations, then. Congratulations. Thank you. Okay. Today was an interesting day for Luis, right? Nice. Yes. Hello, Maria Consuelo. Good evening. Hello, teacher. How are you today, Maria? Uh, I'm fine. Okay, that is good, right? It's good to listen that you are good, you are fine. Hello, Lorena Elizabeth. Hello, Lorena, good evening. Hello, teacher. Hello, Michelle Aguilar, good evening. <clears throat> In Mer Mercedes Elena, good evening. Okay, let's start with today's class. Good evening to everyone. Uh, it's a pleasure to be with you today. It is nice to see you. Uh, today we are, uh, there are a few students today. I hope they uh, get connected soon. Espero que se conecten pronto, ¿verdad? So, tell me, how are you doing on the, on the platform? ¿Cómo van las cosas en la plataforma? Nice, okay. nice. Nice, ok. Have you already finished the section number two? ¿Ya terminaron la sección número dos que era para hoy? Yes. Yes, yes. teacher. Yes. Ok, excellent. Congratulations, right? 
uh, who is working, who is already working on section number three? ¿Quién ya está trabajando en la sección tres? In section number three. Okay, Lorena, Ronald, tú. Okay. Okay, congratulations. Michelle Aguilar, tú. Lucila Patricia, tú. María Consuelo. En la okay. tres todavía no. Ah, todavía no en la tres. Ah, okay. Bueno. Falta para terminar, o sea, todo. Ah, ok, perfecto. Congratulations, then. Excelente, ¿verdad? Yes. Do you have any question? No question. Ok. Bueno, ¿hay algún problema con algún ejercicio de la plataforma? Section 1, Section 2, or Section 3. Bueno, los que llevaban más adelantados, section four, section five. Do you have any question about that? No question. No hay ninguna pregunta acerca de los ejercicios de la plataforma. No question. Ok. Bueno. Eh, recordarles, ¿verdad? La importancia de que completen esos ejercicios, ¿verdad? Sí. Ustedes pueden avanzar tanto como quieran en los ejercicios si logran terminar los ejercicios de la plataforma antes de que terminen las clases virtuales. Mejor, ¿verdad? De hecho, ese es el objetivo, ¿verdad? Que la plataforma esté finalizada antes de terminar las sesiones virtuales, ¿verdad? Tiene que estar un día antes, un día antes de la última sesión virtual. Esa plataforma tiene que estar completada, mínimo el 80%, ¿verdad? Y para la próxima semana tenemos el midterm. Tiene el examen de medio curso que tiene que tomarlo. Está un poco largo, ¿verdad? pero podemos hacerlo. ¿verdad? You can do it, right? You are a great student. And I know that you have solved all the exercise in section one, in section two, and in section three. So you are going to be able to solve the midterm with a great job, right? And get a great job. Y obtener, hacer un buen trabajo and get a really, really great score, right? Y tener una buena nota. Recuerde que los ejercicios puede hacerlos cuantas veces quiera, ¿verdad? Si uno le aparece mal, puede corregirlo, no hay ningún problema. El punto es que aprendamos, ¿verdad? Que aprendamos todos. So, do you have any question? ¿Tienen alguna pregunta? No question today, no problems on the platform exercise today. No. Okay, excellent. Bueno, recuerde, ¿verdad? Que si durante la clase, ¿verdad? Usted tiene alguna pregunta, usted puede levantar su manita y puede interrumpir, ¿verdad? En este caso, Madeline Lisset tiene una pregunta. Dígame, Madeline, what is your question? Buenas noches. Uh, Hello, good evening. Consulta. Yes, what is your question? En cuanto al en cuanto a los adjetivos, um, creo que en la, Sería bueno que todos apagáramos el micrófono. En cuanto a los adjetivos. Eh, ¿Se me escucha? Sí. Y un poco cortado, la verdad. Se le escucha un poco cortado. Pero... Tell me, tell me. Try to tell me. What is okay. the equation? En cuanto, en cuanto a la sección 3, eh, hay una práctica en la que utilizamos los adjetivos. Entonces, ahí debemos poner la profesión más el adjetivo, ¿verdad? Ok, yes, the profesión. Mi duda the es que eh, siempre se le debe poner la pleca. No, la pleca solo está para dividir la fórmula, ¿verdad? Que está ahí. 
De hecho, el día de hoy vamos a aprender eso, ¿verdad? Entonces, al final de la clase me dice si se solucionó la duda, porque ese es el tema que vamos a estudiar justamente el día de hoy, ¿verdad? Objective Perfecto, placement. Gracias. Ok, entonces al final me dice, sí, teacher, la duda está resuelta, ¿verdad? Y si no, pues explicamos nuevamente, no hay problema. Eh, si no hay alguna otra pregunta, entonces no son, eh, la sección 2, finish, right? Y that has been already finished, that is already finished. Está terminada de sección 2. And we are going to start with section number 3, right? Tienen que empezar ya a resolverla, ¿verdad? Ya viene el fin de semana. Si tienen un poco de tiempo libre, pueden trabajar en la plataforma. En la plataforma también van a encontrar algunos videos. ¿verdad? Ahí hay, en, de hecho, en cada tema, ¿verdad? En cada tema hay videos explicativos que son bastante cortos, ¿verdad? Los videos no duran más de, no duran más de cinco minutos, ¿verdad? Algunos pasan seis, seis y medio, lo más, ¿verdad? Entonces también podemos verlos en todas las secciones, ¿verdad? En todas las secciones usted va a encontrar esos videos explicativos. Con ayuda de esos videos podemos ir resolviendo, ¿verdad? Pueden ir resolviendo antes de ver la clase conmigo. Esos videos le pueden ayudar. Y no olvide anotar, ¿verdad? Acá están marcados los videos. Look at this. This is 3.1 video jokes vocabulary and activities. Lo que estuvimos viendo el día de ayer, ¿verdad? Pronunciation, redu reduction, and of do and does. Eh, simple present, double equation in conversation. He works in a hotel. Esto es lo que vimos el día de ayer, ¿verdad? Y acá está en los videos. Placing of objective in conversation. That's exciting. Acá este es el punto que vamos a ver el día de hoy, ¿verdad? Y acá están los ejercicios. Here are the exercises. So you can easily can play these videos. Fácilmente puede darle play a estos videos. Ok. Look at this. For a minute and five seconds. They are short, right? They are short. And you find the explanation of the following exercise. Usted escucha la explicación de los ex ejercicios que siguen a cada uno de los videos. Entonces podemos hacer uso de ellos, ¿verdad? Pueden darle play las veces que Teacher. necesiten. ¿no? Muy bien. Pueden reproducir los videos las veces que lo necesiten. ¿Preguntas? ¿Do you have any question? No question. Bueno, si no hay las preguntas, let's go with today class. Let's go with today class. I'm going to share with you this, my screen, the presentation of today. Eh, here it is. Okay, we are going to wait to see the whole screen. Okay, let me know, please, if you can see my presentation. Can you see my screen? Yes. 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 Arriba. Okay, I'm going to try it again. Vamos a dejarme compartir. And let's start again with this. Okay. Can you still see the gray bar? Puedo todavía puede ver la barra. No, 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 it's good. No, okay. Is it, is it perfect? Yes, it is or no, it yes. isn't? Yes, yes, it is. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Yes. Yes, it is. Yes. Okay, very good. In today's topic, we're going to learn about placement of adjectives. Vamos a aprender cómo va posicionado el adjetivo, ¿verdad? En las oraciones. But before to go to that topic, antes de ir a ese tema, we are going to have a review of the last class. Do you remember what we studied yesterday? What did we study yesterday? ¿Se acuerdan que estudiamos el yes. día de ayer? Yesterday, uh, yes. Vocabulary. Okay, we'll learn some vocabulary about jobs, right? 
Yeah. Acerca de algunos trabajos. But today we're going to have to review and we are going to start with places to work. Vimos algunos lugares donde trabajan las personas, dependiendo de la profesión de cada quien. So let's go with the first question. Okay, who works in a hospital? Who works in a hospital? No. No. Doctor. A doctor. A doctor. A nurse. A nurse. A nurse. A nurse. A nurse. A nurse too, right? The social worker. Okay, a social worker. Yes, right? You're right. Okay, now we are going to do some things. Um, vamos a utilizar el chat, right? Okay, we have the chart here and I'm going to say like, hello. Can you see that message on the chat? So listen, yes. uh, okay, you are going to read the question and you have to write the answer. Usted tiene que escribir la respuesta en el chat. Vamos a ver quién lo hace primero. So, alisten sus dedos, ¿verdad? Okay, get ready with the finger. You are going to tie the correct answer. Okay, and I'm going to see here who write first the answer. This is a contest, right? It's una competencia, guys. So let's try to do it quickly. Intentemos hacerlo rápido. Here we go. The next question is, who works in an office? Who works in an office? Can you please tie the answer? Don't say the answer, right? Don't say the answer. Tie the answer. Yeah. Okay. Okay, Miss Catherine Hissel, you were the okay, you were the faster, right? You write so quickly. And the first question, the first answer is for Ricardo de Jesus and also Catherine Hissel. Okay, and you say secretary, a content, a content, un contador. Okay, a lawyer, a receptionist. Yes, right, you are right. Okay. Are you ready for the next question? Are you ready for the next question? Here we go. The next question is, who works in a school? Who works in a school? Okay. Catherine Giselle Melendez, Miss Catherine again. Okay, right, a teacher, a teacher. Okay, Noel Navidad, you were near too, right? You were so close, teacher. Teacher, Roberto de Leon, teacher, yes, right? Teacher, 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 okay, yes. Okay. Madeline Lissette say, tengo dificultades de señal debido a la lluvia. Okay, we understand, no problem, we understand. Next question, are you ready? Get ready for the next question. And the next question is, who works in a restaurant? Who works in a restaurant? Who works in a restaurant? Okay, and I have um, a student. No, we have a waiter. Yes, pero no es la manera correcta, okay? You say waiter. What is waiter, right? W-A-I-T-E-R. Chef, muy bien, Ricardo de Jesús, chef. Uh, Ricardo de Jesús, waiter. María Consuelo, chef. María Chorro, de chef, yes. Noel Alvide Escobar, waiter. Ronald Antonio, say waitress. Um, yes, waitress, but W-A, right? W-A, waitress. Yeah, okay, waiter, the waitress, the waitress, chef, chef, chef. Excellent, very good answer, guys. Thank you. Look at the next question. Get ready for the next one. The next question is, who works in a store? Who works in a store? Who works in a store? Who works in a store, guys? So let me check your answer. Okay, as a psychologist, right? Cashier, cashier, yes. Uh, cashier, yes. A salesperson, yes, very good. Michelle Aguilar and Ricardo de Jesus again. Okay, you are doing very good, right? You are so fast to write. Eh, cashier, Lorena Elisette. Se le fue una L allí, ¿verdad? Cashier, salesperson. 
Cashing, no, cashing, that is not the correct answer. It's cashier. Salesperson, yes. Okay, excellent. So get ready for the next one. You are doing a great job, right? So here we go with the next one. You are so good at typing. Son muy buenos escribiendo. Congratulations. The next question is, who works in a supermarket? Who works in a supermarket? Who works in a supermarket? A security guard. Muy bien, excellent. Martin, muy bien, a security guard. Miss Milagro de Los Angeles Pérez, a cashier. Mr. Luis Alonso, say a cashier. Yes, you are right. Y, okay, very good. So let's go over the next question. The next question is, who works in an airport? Who works in an airport? Milagro de Los Angeles, Miss Milagro de Los Angeles, congratulations, you were the first one. Fue la primera, then you say a pilot, a pilot. Catherine himself, you were close, right? Estuvo muy cerca. Miriam Rocío Rendón, you were close, right? Eh, okay, let's go to the next one. Who works in a police station? Who works in a police station? And veamos, Maria Chorro dice, a flight attendant. A flight attendant, yes. And Roxana Marcela Garcia say, a pilot. Excellent answer. Martin say, a pilot. Lorena Lizette, excellent, a pilot. Noel Albit, flight attendant. Okay, pay attention to the word attendant, right? Attendant is with double T. Attendant. Okay, flight attendant. Pilot, pilot. Okay, excellent. Katia Elizabeth, too. Okay, and all of you, you did a great job. Uh, you say Batman? Batman were in the a police station? <laughs> <laughs> really? Oh, okay. Oh, well. <laughs> well, in the movie, uh, he doesn't work there, right? Él tiene una baticueva, right? <laughs> okay, excellent answer. Thank you. Uh, we have another question. We still have one question. And who works in a court? Lawyer, judge. Okay, excellent. Law, lawyers. Ah, uh, yeah, lawyer, but is. Uh, in a restaurant, I don't listen very well, dice Martin. Los demás sí me pueden escuchar bien. Can you listen? Yes. Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. Yes. 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 Secretary. Yes. Right. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Secretary, lawyer. Les falta una Police. persona. Judge. Oh, yes. Police yes. and judge. Okay. Roberto León. Say lawyer, security, security guard or police. Excellent. Let's see who works in a cafeteria. Who works in a cafeteria? Who works in a cafeteria? A waitress. Okay, Martin. Excellent. Waitress. Milagro de Los Angeles. Say, a waitress. Yes. A chef. A cashier. A waitress. Yes. Your answer is right. A salesperson. Okay, very good. Okay, excellent answer. A uh, dishwasher, a uh, dishwasher, mm, no, um, probablemente sí podemos encontrar uno en una cafetería, ¿verdad? pero no es un empleado, ¿verdad? that is a machine, right? Es una máquina, okay. dishwasher. And it is in this way, dish. It is like dish, mm. dish washer. Dishwasher es el lavatrastes, ¿verdad? Okay. Let's go with the next team. Thank you guys for all the ones who participate in this activity. Thank you very much. Gracias a los que participaron en esta actividad. You did a great job, right? And the I other one, that. the other one, I understand probably you are connected uh, through your cell phone, right? You are using your cell phone and it is a little bit hard, right? 
es un poco difícil estar escribiendo en el teléfono usando el chat. I understand you, no problem. So let's go with the next one. We are going to have a review also about activities at work. Um, let's see if you remember these. Let's find out if you remember these. Number one, who stands all day? ¿Qué trabajador pasa parado todo el día? Security guard. Security guard. Security guard. Excellent. Okay. No more chat, right? No more chat. Now you can tell me. You can tell me. Uh, who stands Please all day? A police officer. Yes. A security guard. A police officer. Yes, right? Wait, uh, wait. Cash. Cash or two. Right. Okay, number two, who handles money? Who handles money? ¿Quién se encarga del dinero en los cashier. negocios? A cashier. A cashier, right? A cashier. A cashier. Yes, a cashier. You're right. Next one. Who serves food? Who serves food? Waitress. Chef. Waitress. Waitress. It could be chef, waitress, and waiter. Excellent. Who treats sick people? Who treats sick people? A doctor. Um, a doctor, yes. A, a nurse. nurse. A nurse too. Okay, excellent. Who treats sick people? Mm, no, it is sick. Oh. Sick people. This word means enfermo, right? It treats, es trata, ¿verdad? ¿Quién trata a las personas enfermas? Mm. The doctor, the doctors and nurse. Nurse, nurse, nurse yes, nurse. nurse and doctor. So let's go with the next question. Who told to people? Who talks to people? Receptionist. A lawyer. Salesperson. The next one, who flies a plane? Who flies a plane? A pilot. A pilot. A pilot, yes. A pilot. A pilot, yes. Excellent. You are doing excellent. No problem, right? We are learning. So who teaches students? Yes. Who teacher. 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 A teacher. A teacher. Then who cooks food? Chef. A chef, right? A chef. Yeah. Okay, excellent. Yeah. Okay, no fue a propósito, right? Pero hay una oración que está mala. What is it? Teacher. Teachers. Oh, no. How ah, okay. oh, sí is No, this is okay. Teaches students. Uh -huh. Es el verbo Ay, teach más S de la tercera persona. Uh, right? yeah. Pero, uh, look, look, look. Flies. More. Flies. Who flies a plan? No es con Y ahí, no. Oh, yes, it is. El verbo sin yes. conjugar es con Y, pero como acá estamos en tercera persona, ¿verdad? ¿Quién? Ah, okay. Entonces le agregamos IES, right? IES. Cooks? Cooks? No, that no, is no, okay. No. It's okay, Cooks. <laughs> What is the word? What is the word? Les voy a ayudar más. It's a verb. It's a verb. Es un verbo. Uh, uh, número cuatro. Number four. Who treats C people? No, that is okay. That is okay. Yeah. But you are close. You are close. You are close to find yeah. the answer. Oh, sorry, baby. Which one? Which one? Okay. What number? Number five. Five. Number huh? five. Who five. five. Okay. Who number talk? five. Who talk? Number yeah. five. Who talk? An S is missing, Talks. right? Ah, Talks. Ah, se falta una S. Okay, thank you, guys. You did a great job in this exercise. Thank you so much. So, look at this. Can you answer the following question? Can you answer the following question? And the first one is, what do you do? What do you do? I am a driver. Okay, I am a driver, a taxi driver, a bus driver, a pickup driver. I am studying English. Ah, okay, I am a student. Yo soy un estudiante. I am a student. I'm a student. Okay, what do you do? 
what do you do? That is the question. Can, can you write your answer here on the chat? Pueden escribir su respuesta. Say, I. Pueden escribir su respuesta en el chat. I am. I am. A, I am a soldier. Okay. I am a soldier. I'm a secretary. I'm a chef. I am an analyst. Uh, uh, I am an analyst. Yes, sure. yes, yes. I am a rancher. Okay. I am a student. I am a doctor. I am a housewife. Okay. Excellent. I am a student. I am a cashier. Uh, I'm a student. I am a study. I am a secretary. Okay. It's in this way. I'm going to write here. I'm a student. Student. Ah, yes. I'm a student. I'm an accounting public. I am a pickup driver. I am a. Okay. Para decir contador, we say I am. An accountant. I am an accountant. Accountant. I am a cosmetologist. Okay. Okay, excellent. Okay, very good. No more answer. No more answer. Hey, excellent answer. Thank you. I am a teacher. I'm a teacher, okay. Um, no, I'm looking for that. I'm a secretary and a student. I am a teacher. Miriam Rocio. Yeah. Are, you, are you Miriam Rocio? Okay, yes. I, I'm so sorry, right? Here is your message. Here is your message. I am a teacher. Okay, excellent. I'm a teacher. I, I am a surgeon. Okay, good. Un cirujano, right? I'm a teacher and an accountant. Lorena is a teacher too. Mercedes is a surgeon. Lorena Elizabeth, I am an accountant. Okay, very good answer, right? Let's go over the next question. I am a custom officer. I am a cost customer office. Um, I am a custom officer. Lucila Patricia say. I am a lawyer. Lawyer, lawyer, okay. Roberto is a lawyer. Maria is a lawyer too. Okay, very good. Very good answer, guys. Thank you. Let's see the next question. Where do you work? Where do you work? The next question. Bueno, esta me la pueden decir, ¿verdad? Algunos. Bueno, you can participate and tell me. Where do you work? I think we're in an office. Okay, I work in an office. Yes, excellent answer. Thank you. I am in the custom. I work in a custom. No sé cómo se pronuncia aduana. Ah, okay, aduana. Uh, okay, very good, very good. Uh, very good word. Right? Give me a second. I'm going to look for that. Aduana. Uh, that is nice. Bueno, mientras buscamos esa palabra, can you please? The song one more. I work in the field. I work in the field. Um, yeah. Okay, custom. Custom. Want a custom. Yes, you were right. Custom. Yes, yes. Customs. Yes, that is the correct word. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, Luis, I work in the field. I work I in the field. Okay, I work in the countryside. Okay, in the field. Okay, very good. I work in a restaurant. I work in a restaurant. Thank you. Excellent answer. One more, one more, one more to change position. I so. work at Ministerio de Hacienda. Okay, excellent. I work at the Ministerio de Hacienda, right? Okay. I Let's go with in it. The, in the high school? In the school? 
Okay, I work in a school. Excellent. I work in a school. What do you do there? ¿Se acuerdan de las actividades? What do you do there? Okay, three I, answer. Three answer. I work in a different activity. 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 Activities. Activities. Yes. I work in different activities. Okay. Nice. I what are I work in I work in okay. I work in computer. Uh, okay. Uh, when we work in a computer, Windows, we don't say write. We use the verb type. 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 I I type on the computer. Type. That is the okay. correct verb. Type. Uh, I see. I see the milking of the cow. Okay, excellent. That is an interesting job. Is that interesting? Okay, yes. Mil the milking process, right? Yes. Do you supervise the milking process? Okay. How do you like your work? How do you like your work? I love it. I like it. I love it. I like it. Okay. I like it. I really like it. I really, I like, really it. like it. Okay. Who say I hate? I hate my job. Nobody? No. 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 <laughs> Pueden ver el video después. <laughs> okay. How do you like your work? So let's go with the next thing. Here, look at her. What does she do? What does she do? She is a receptionist. She is a receptionist. Okay, thank you. She's a receptionist. Yes, yeah, she's a receptionist. She is a receptionist. She is receptionist. Okay. Um, next question. Let's go with the next question. I don't know who draw this line right on the screen, but I can uh, take it out. Where does she work? Where does she work? She work in the office. Okay. She work in an office. She, she work in hotel. To she works in hotel. Yes. She work in a uh, hospital. She works in a hospital. Excellent. She work in a hospital. Eh, la oración anterior es una actividad. ¿Qué es lo que ella hace? Es para la siguiente pregunta. It's for the next question. Sí, nos adelantó. Very good. Thank you. Okay. Uh, she talks to people, right? Esa es una actividad que ella realiza. But very good job. Thank you. And that is, that is the next question. What does she do there, right? What does she do there? She talks to people. She's right? a tender. Yeah, okay. No. Okay, she yes, helps right? People. She helps people, right? She helps people she to, to register, to book in in a hotel. She helps, she helps people too. So how does she like her job? Look at the small face here. How does she like her job? She like yeah. Yeah. Okay. She doesn't like her job, right? She That's hates okay. it. She hates it. <laughs> and look at this picture. Excuse me, imagine. Look at the following picture. And here is the first question. We're going to hurry. What does he do? He's a waitress. He's, He's a, a cook. A cook. She's a kiss. He's a cook. He is a chef. Where does he work? She works in the kitchen. He works in the kitchen. He works in a restaurant. He works in the kitchen. What does he do there? She cooks she uh, the food. Okay, he serves food. Cooks the food. Work hard. She cooks the food. He works hard. He cooks. Excellent. Cooks. How does he like her his job? Sorry, this is his. Forget it about this, right? It's his. How does he like his job? He likes it. He likes it. He likes it. He likes it. Okay, excellent. He likes it. 
Okay, okay. excellent. Okay. Let's go with today's topic. And we're going to read this small conversation. Can you please listen? Turn off your microphone. You are going to listen to this small conversation. The conversation is between Richard and Stephanie. Richard says, hey, Stephanie, I hear you have a new job. Yes, I'm teaching math at Lincoln High School. How do you like it? It's great. The students are terrific. How are things with you? No bad. I'm a firefighter now, you know. That's, that's exciting. Yes, but it is but it's a very stressful job and sometimes it's dangerous. So listen again. Hey, Stephanie, I hear, I heard you have a new job. Yes, I'm a teaching math at Lincoln High School. How do you like it? It's great. The students are terrific. How are things with you? Not bad. I'm a firefighter now. You know, that's exciting. Yes, but it's a very stressful job and sometimes it's dangerous. Now, let's see what does Richard do? Can you help me with that equation? What does Richard do? What does Richard do? According to the conversation. Maron, Maron. He does, he, he does uh, a fireman. fireman. Ah, okay. He's a firefighter. Okay, excellent. Ah, eso se dedica, ¿verdad? What does Richard do? He's a firefighter. Let's go with the next question. What does Stephanie do? What does Stephanie do? She's a, a teacher. Okay, she's a teacher. What subject does she teach? De qué materia? Math. 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 She's a math teacher. Excellent. How does Stephanie like it? How does Stephanie like her work? She. Estudiante de. Okay. No. She like. She like it, right? She, she like, like it, right? She say it's great. The students are terrific. The students are awesome. The students are fantastic, right? So she really like it. And okay. How is Richard's job? Look at this. How is Richard's job? ¿Cómo es el trabajo de Richard? Exciting. Very stressful. Yeah. Stressful job. And sometimes it's dangerous. It's dangerous, right? It's estresante y peligroso. Okay. So we are going to study this today in right? Objectives. We're going to look at this example. We're going to study this. Adjective plus verb B. And we have here this structure. We are going to start the sentences with an article. Vamos a comenzar la oración con el artículo A o an. Um, plus a profession, más una profesión. Plus the apostrophe. Esto significa pertenencia, ¿verdad? Y the apostrophe, plus the verb be, más el verbo to be, plus the objective. Más el adjetivo. And I have here some examples. A police officer job is dangerous. A police officer job is dangerous. Then I have here the article, the profession, the apostrophe. Okay. And the verb be and the adjective. So a police officer job is dangerous. Madeline Lisette, what is your question? Madeline Lisette. En el caso de security work, sí. ¿a dónde ah. llevaría el apóstrofe? Ok, a security guard, justo después de guard, a security guard. Apóstrofe, job, ¿verdad? 
Then I have this other example, a doctor. A doctor's job is stressful. An engineer's job is interesting. El trabajo de un ingeniero es interesante. Entonces, este apóstrofe significa de verdad. A doctor's job. El trabajo de un doctor. An engineer's job. El trabajo de un ingeniero. Y acá el verbo to be más el adjetivo. Hay otra manera de decir estas oraciones y es utilizando este verbo, has. We are going to use an article. Puede ser a o an. Plus a profession. Más una profesión. Plus the verb has. Plus the article a o an again. Una vez más el artículo a o an. Plus an adjective. Más un adjetivo, plus a noun. And I have here, a police officer has a dangerous job. Look, it's the same sentence, right? A police officer's job is dangerous. Es una manera de decirlo. Y otra manera sería, a police officer has a dangerous job. A doctor's job is stressful. A doctor has a stressful job. An engineer's job is interesting. An engineer has an interesting job. Entonces podemos utilizar los adjetivos de estas dos maneras. Con el verbo to be. Y con el verbo to have. Que significa tener. A police officer has a dangerous job. Tiene un trabajo peligroso. ¿no? Ok. Do you have any question? Do we have any question? Okay, let me see here. Okay. Okay, no question, then let's continue. Let's see this slide. Okay. Express your opinion. And we have here some, some objective. Can you please say this objective with me? Boring. 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 Okay, here we go. Boring. Easy. Boring. Easy. Easy. Dangerous. 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 Exciting. Dangerous. Exciting. 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 Difficult. 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 Ex oh, sorry, I write exciting Ex again. Stressful. 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 Okay. Stressful. Okay, and I have here an example. A veterinarian's job is difficult. A veterinarian's job is difficult. Okay, excellent. El trabajo de un veterinario es difícil. Es difícil. Okay, what about a doctor? A doctor. ¿Cuál de estos adjetivos creen que aplica para ese trabajo? Stressful. Stressful? Okay. Yeah. Can we say the sentence with me? A, doc, a doctor's, doctor's job, job is stressful. Job is stressful. stressful. Okay. What about a firefighter? A firefighter. Dangerous. Okay. Can you please say the sentence? A, a firefighter. Office. A police office. Yes. Dangerous. dangerous. It's dangerous. Okay, Can you, uh, what about a teacher? What about a teacher? A teacher exciting. job. A teacher's job is exciting. Okay, can you say the sentence with me? A teacher's job is exciting. Exciting. Okay. What about a nurse? What about a nurse? Difficult. Difficult. Okay. Time. Okay. Can you dangerous too? Dangerous. Is no. it dangerous to be a nurse? Oh, yeah. no. it's stressful. Oh, it's stressful too. Okay. Okay. Let's choose difficult uh, for this example. So, can you say with me a nurse? A nurse job is difficult. Yeah. It's yes, difficult. difficult. Okay, once again, say this objective with me. Boring, easy, dangerous, 
Okay, stressful, stressful, stressful. Okay, excellent. Let's see another couple of adjectives. Here we have another list, and I have safe, relaxing, glamorous, monotonous, challenging, rewarding, stimulating, repetitive, and admirable. And I have this example. A teacher has a challenging job. In this case, we're going to use the option has, right? A teacher has a challenging, challenging job. A teacher has a challenging job. Los maestros tienen un trabajo challenging, que tienen Desafiante. muchos retos, ¿verdad? Desafiante. OK. OK, what about a singer? What about a singer, un cantante? ¿Qué adjetivo podríamos decir? A singer has... Glamorous. Okay, excellent. A singer has a glamorous job, right? Glamorous uh, tiene que ver con la admiración, que lo admiran las personas. They take some pictures and they, Okay, relaxing too. That could be right. Okay, and what about a cashier? ¿Cuál de esos adjetivos? Cashier. A cashier has. Mm -hmm. Uh, uh, repetitive. repetitive repetitive okay a cashier has a repetitive job, job. okay uh, can you tell me what is a relaxing job what could be a relaxing job a singer okay a singer has a relaxing job can you please say the sentence with me? A singer has a relaxing, relaxing job. 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 Okay, excellent. Job. Uh, what about rewarding? Rewarding. Mm. Rewarding. Mm. <clears throat> uh, um, a chef. A chef. A chef has a rewarding job. Okay, a stimulating. Stimulating. Um, doctor. A doctor has a stimulating job. Okay, that could be an admirable. ¿Cuál es un trabajo admirable? Who has an a admirable doctor. job? A doctor, um, yes. A doctor has an admirable job. A teacher. A teacher a has teacher. an admirable job. Excellent. It's a pilot. A pilot. Firefighter. A firefighter too, right? Has an admirable job. Okay, what right. about chef. A, a chef? Yes, a chef, right? A chef, a chef has an admirable because. job. Okay, thank you. So let's see, thank you. We are going to have some practice. So do you have any question? Do you still have question about this topic? Preguntas acerca del tema de hoy, no question. Oh, teacher, it's okay. Okay, I can see that Noel is speaking, but I don't know. If... Turn on your microphone, Noel. Uh, no, no, no. Era un audio de mi trabajo, lo siento, teacher. Ah, okay, okay, no problem. No problem, thank you. Well, so what do we learn today? Ya aprendimos el día de hoy. What do we learn today, guys? About okay. Vocabulary. In today's class, we learn vocabulary about an adjective. Uh, adjetivos para describir los trabajos, ¿verdad? For example. Which one, for example? Easy. Ok, easy, easy. Um, ¿Cuál será un trabajo en el que podamos utilizar este adjetivo? Easy. Wait. Wait. Difficult. Ok. 
Okay, we're going to write a list here, over here. So the next one is difficult. Yes, difficult. Which other one? Tell me. Easy, difficult. Dangerous. 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 Stressful. Exciting. Stressful. Exciting. E exciting. Yes, exciting. Which other one? Tell me. Boring. 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 Yes, boring. Boring is another adjective which we learned today. So also hard. 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 Yes, hard. Which other one? You say admirable. Mm -hmm. Admirable. Which other one? Difficult, easy, difficult, dangerous, stressful, exciting, boring, hard, admirable. Amorous. It's guarding. Okay, glamorous. Glamorous. Which other one? Can you please repeat? Rewarding. Oh, rewarding. 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 And one more, one more. The last, one more, one more adjective. Relaxing. Okay, relaxing, yes. Then we learned the place of this adjective in the sentence. Aprendimos también el lugar, ¿verdad? De los adjetivos en una oración. And the first one is with the verb be, right? Do you remember that? Let's see, for example, a singer... Uh, doctor. Okay, a single yeah. job where uh, B is, uh, is, a a a is is a is a boring. Um, boring. boring. Okay. Exciting. Okay. It's a, a, exciting. A single job is exciting. Exciting uh, or Relaxing. Okay, let me write this in again. Uh, singer's job is glamorous. 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 Is glamorous. Okay. Uh, what about a waiter? A waiter. A waiter. A waiter. A waiter's job is. A waiter's job is hard. 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 Okay. It's hard. It's hard. Yes. What about a pilot? A pilot. A pilot. A pilot's job, job is, is admirable. Okay. Admirable. Thank you. And the last one with this way. Uh, let's see. A nurse. A nurse. A nurse. A nurse, sorry, is with him. A nurse. A nurse job is stress, stressful. Stressful. Okay. A nurse job is stressful. Ahora vamos a hacerlo con el verbo to have, right? Veamos a teacher. A teacher has a Okay, en ese caso va a ser a o an a, a admirable an. job o an admirable job. An. Okay. An. Sí. An. Bye. Como la siguiente palabra comienza con el sonido de una vocal, ¿verdad? Entonces tengo que utilizar an. An admirable. An admirable. Job. 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 Excelente. Y we have a period, right? Ponemos un punto final a la oración. And we start another one. Uh, tell me, um, what about a lawyer? A lawyer. A lawyer. A lawyer has, has 
Okay, a stressful job. job. A stressful job. And what about a soccer player? What about a professional soccer player? Uh, a professional uh, soccer player has an exciting, exciting. Okay, an exciting job. Exciting. An exciting. exciting job. Excellent. What about a mechanic? A mechanic? What about a mechanic has a extra extra job? Uh, has a stressful uh, job? Difficult. 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 Okay, difficult. A mechanic has, has a difficult. A difficult? A difficult job. job. A difficult job. Excellent. A mechanic has a difficult job. Okay, and then we have two ways, right? We have two ways to use adjective. One is with the verb be, using the verb be in this structure, right? Article a o n, profession plus the apostrophe. The word job, the verb be, and the adjective. The other way is to use a or an. Any of this article, it depend depend right. It depends on the following work, and we have the profession the verb mm -hmm. has plus the article a o n again, the objective and the word job right. That those are the two ways to use objective right. Do you have any question? Do you have any question, guy? No. No. Okay. No. Okay, now, no questions, no hay preguntas. Bueno, entonces recordarle, ¿verdad? Recordarle. Ah, okay, Oscar, Baltasar, what is your question? Perdón, quizá regálenme unos minutos después que termine la clase, por favor. Ah, okay, excelente. Entonces, cuando terminemos, eh, que ya casi es, ¿verdad? Eh, me quedo con usted, ¿verdad? ¿Alguien más tiene alguna duda? Do you have any question? Bueno, si no hay más okay. preguntas, pues, okay. thank you, ¿verdad? Thank you for being here with me. Thank you for connecting to this uh, English class. I hope to see you next Monday, right? Today is Thursday. Uh, tiene el fin de semana, ¿verdad? Tomorrow we don't have classes. Uh, on the weekends, no classes. So you can take advantage of that time frame. Puede aprovechar ese tiempo and work on the platform. Trabaje en la plataforma, ¿verdad? Please, right? Yes. You need to complete those exercises. Okay, okay. congratulations you, to the ones. Congratulations to the ones who has already finished the platform. Uh, the ones who has finished the section one and section two, congratulations. Eh, felicidades a los que ya completaron hasta la sección 2 y los que no pues teníamos hasta hoy verdad so you can do it right you can do it you are doing a great job right y if you can practice you can see the video of the class you can see the videos on the platform so you have material to practice right you are going to have today's presentation va a tener la presentación del día de hoy está el video de la clase okay. Los videos en la plataforma, then you can practice. Usted puede practicar, right? Recuerde que entre más practica, mejor va a ser en el, en el uso del idioma, ¿verdad? So, practice, right? Y felicidades a todos los que van bien avanzados en la plataforma. Los demás podemos alcanzarlos, right? We can do that, right? Póngase la meta este fin de semana. Voy a dejar a mis compañeros. Nada, that's not true, right? <laughs> Todos tenemos que completar eso. Okay. So, but you can do it, right? You can do it. And you are doing a great okay. job. So, thank you, guys. Uh, have, a, you. have a good night. <laughs> Sleep well. Bye-bye. Okay. See you bye -bye. next Monday. See bye you next friends. Monday. Bye-bye. Thank you, teacher. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. See you on Monday. Thank you. You're welcome. Bye-bye.